Okay, guys. They're just being dicks with my live feed, so I'm going to go in here and pre-record this so you guys can see it, okay? All right, now, see that bluff over there? Okay, to the, I, I would say to the uh, picture, uh, video right, that bush right uh, there. Uh, I don't know, there's like a whole bunch of bushes, but furthest one from this thing, and there's a, right behind it is a bluff, a sort of, I don't know what you call that, it's a bluff, or a big giant rock right there, okay, there's a plateau right there, well, the one in the foreground, the very closest one to us, if you look at that, you can zoom in or, you know, take a snapshot or a screenshot of it, you can see that that's the farm, okay? The CIA, the FBI, uh, Homeland Security, they all run uh, operations out of that place. They do skydiving once in a great while. Uh, occasionally, they do agent ground training um, activities and all kinds of crazy shit up there, all right? That's the farm, the one that, that everybody talks about. It's right here in Colorado, okay? And government officials are always flying in here in their fucking Lear jets. There's an airport right down the street from that. What you're looking at, the base, or in the foreground of that, is the airport. Okay? That's the airport. That's the fucking airport right there. And that's where they come in. All right? All those CIA and FBI and motherfuckers, they come in. And they drive down, down into Florence and they drive down into... Um, I can't remember the name of the street, but they go out there to Rockville, and they go on to other places like the farm. And I want you guys to, to know the base, the very farthest base of that to the towards the mountain there, at the base of that foreground uh, plateau is the farm. Okay, it's a farm that a prison maintains. Okay, it's a government piece of property. All right, I've gone and. There's another bluff uh, off to the distance there. That's this tree, this bush is blocking it. But uh, I can tell you that I've been up high enough like this where I can see this wonderful, uh, right over, almost over looking down into it. I used my binoculars to look down into it. And you can see people in black suits, you can see people in orange jumpsuits and gray jumpsuits and people that are fucking maintaining the farm, okay? They're working with horses and they're working with animals and making it look like a farm when there's really CIA activities and they're cleaning the farm, mowing, harvesting, doing things like that and trying to, you know, provide industry for and money for that, that, it, that prison, okay? They make money that way. They use people as slaves, so, this is like the, the prison capital of the freaking Colorado, all right? They got, know, let me look over here a little bit more, and you can see the snow-capped mountains, so beautiful in the background there, all right? But right down, right in that little, between these bushes right here, see? All right, between the little low spot in the bushes there, if you look across, that's a pretty good prison right there, all right? Another prison. All right, a huge one. And they've even, in Canyon City, they've got the huge prison museum. Okay, it used to be an old prison back in like the 50s and 60s. They closed it because the building is falling apart. And they turned it into a um, prison museum. All right, and they've got this nasty sort of feeling to it. All right, and it's like, I can't, it's suffocating to me. I can't be anywhere near it, and, and you can't be, I mean, you've got so much law enforcement there in Canyon City, it's crawling with law enforcement. You can't make a move without them knowing what the fuck you're doing, okay? And same way in Florence, it's crawling with corrupt law enforcement. I don't want a bunch of motherfuckers looking at me and watching every fucking move I make. I mean, do they want to know what kind of toilet paper I use and... How I wipe my ass? I guess they watch that too. I'm sick of that. There's no privacy in this world. And we're going to... Things are going to start changing. Okay? Alright? 
things are going to start changing real fucking quick. All right. For real. I am tired of the non-transparency and the, and the bullshit that we have to go through the surveillance state. I mean, you can't take a shit anymore without assholes in the sky. All right. Trying to spy on you and watch you take a shit through infrared freaking satellite through, through your, through your roof. And you think I'm crazy, but that's the, that's the system teaching other people. Oh yeah, he's crazy because that way it's discredited, but it's the truth. Okay. The real truth. And they don't want the truth getting out there. And so they want to discredit people like me. All right. So I just showed you the farm. Okay. That's truth. That's hard reality in video. Can't deny it. Ain't no way. So if I, if, if that, I'm showing you the truth, I am shining a light into the shadow and they don't want that, that information brought out there. So I'm going to put it out there, whether they want me to or not. And in return, you know what they're giving me every couple of years, they give me a little taste of freedom and then they get, they take it away again. They want to suppress me. And the more they want to repress and suppress me, the more I push against them, the more I resist. It's like a Chinese finger trap. The more that you try to pull out, the harder I try to pull. And, and eventually I'm going to get out of all this shit. And they have no hard evidence in my current case. Okay. I never even committed the crime. They had, and even the statement that, sh that, that my father made can be used in a court of law. <coughs> <coughs> and yeah, it would be hearsay and conjecture because it's third party, but at least they could rectify and verify that she said so. So, you know what? I'm going to win this case. And if I lose, I go to one of those prisons that you see there. All right. Probably one in Florence. And I don't want to go there. And for what? A crime I never committed? The fuck are you trying to do to me? You know? That's called repression. You know why? Because my light shines into the darkness. Okay? Where they don't want it to shine. I'm exposing all of this crap that they're trying to do. That's what my purpose on this earth is for. Okay? I'm shining, it's like I'm the beacon. I'm a beacon, okay? Beacon of light, just emanating all over the place. The brightest freaking LED light that, I mean, white light you can ever see is shining into the shadows, okay? It's creating more shadows, but it's also shining into the shadows, okay? Light creates shadows, as we know, okay? Metaphorically speaking, my light is is going to expose all of the happenings in the shadows. Okay? They don't want that. The spies, the the uh infrared satellites, I've already exposed that. Okay? That was real. They posted that shit to my to their Facebook page. And if I could find that guy or girl, whoever, probably guy from the energy I felt I felt to that. I want that picture back. I want that picture and I want to prove, okay, what my room looked like back in my old apartment. All right. He traced the screen. That was his drawing. And it's not proprietary information. It's his drawing. It's, it's in his hand, which means that it's legal to post. So why did he lose his job? Because why? Simple. Because he traced the screen and, and got exposed. Uh, they, the NSA got burned by me. <laughs> so they're watching me right now, like a hawk. You know why they're doing that? Cause I expose them. I'm doing an expose on the ass. Yeah. Anyway, this is pre-recorded, so they can't edit it. Ha ha. They can try to block it, but I'll just have it on the phone. I'll put it on YouTube and put a link to the fucking thing. And then YouTube will try to do it. Be like, oh, let's take it down. But I've got the original video. I'll put it on a file sharing website. Put a link to that on my Facebook. 
my Twitter, my Instagram, and I'll take some snapshots or screenshots and put the link up and people will be able to download it and watch it locally on their computers and their phones. So they can't stop that shit. All right. All right. Later.